Hello friends, I hope that all of you are doing well. I hope that your first week at home learning was smooth. Um, as you know, if you ever need anything, you can contact one of your teachers and we will do our very best to help. Uh, last week, we uh, were talking about counting on to add. Remember, we do not start at zero. We start at um, what not the number that's in the equation and then we count on. So as I know, I can I have five plus two right here is five blocks and then I'm going to add on two. So six, then seven. So I know that five plus two is seven. Now, uh, the other skill that we talked about last week was adding with near doubles and uh, just doubles. So we remember uh, had our fingers. We had two, four, six, eight, and ten. When we add with doubles, as you can see, we have one plus one. So one plus one equals two. And then we had two plus two and two plus two equals four. Now, when we add with near doubles, we are just adding on one more. So we have one plus two equals, good, three. One plus two equals three. The last problem that we have is two plus three equals, good, five. Now, we also talked about, um, how with the doubles are even numbers, and we talked about the near doubles are odd numbers. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 are even numbers. 3, 5, 7, 9 are odd numbers. Okay? So today we are going to be talking about adding in any order using near doubles. Remember, a lot of these lessons are review. Okay, we have talked about most of these things in class. So, um, you, when you add in any order, you can add the factors in any order and the product will be the same. The product is what it equals. Okay, the product will be the same. So, for example, on a school day, the bus comes and picks you up. You commute to work the same, or to school the same way and you come home the same way, okay? So, let's practice these problems together. As you can see, I have colored in three blocks, and then we have six left. So three plus six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three plus six equals nine, okay? <laughs> this way, I have colored in six cubes and left three blank, but Six plus three equals nine. You can add it in any way and you'll still get the same product, okay? So on number two, we have four plus three. So I'm gonna color in four cubes and I have three that are not colored in. Four plus three equals one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, on this one, I'm just going to color in three cubes, and I have four right here. Three plus four equals seven. It's the same thing, just flip-flopped. You can add it in any order, okay? Next one, two plus seven, so I colored in two, and I'm going to count on three, four, five, six, Seven. Oh, wait. Sorry, I did not add enough cubes. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two plus seven equals nine. Now, I'm going to color in seven. How many do I have left? Two. So 
seven, eight, nine. I can add it in any way. It doesn't matter. Now, number four. I'm going to color in one, and I have six left. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One plus six is seven. Now, I'm going to color in six, because that's what we're starting with, and I have one left. Six, and I'm going to count on. Seven. One plus six equals seven, and six plus one equals seven. I'm adding in any order using near doubles, okay? The last one, we have three plus two. So I'm going to color in three cubes. And we have two left. So three, four, five. Three plus two equals five. Last one, I'm going to color in two. And I have three right here. So two, three, four, five. Three plus two equals five, and two plus three equals five. We are adding in any order using near doubles. Okay? Now that we have practiced the skill, it is your turn uh, um, doing um, your page. So you will complete the adding in any order using near doubles on your own. Remember, only do what me and Miss Kersey assign. Continue doing Lexia and Dreambox and let us know if you have any questions. Um, I hope that you guys have a great rest of your day, um, and we miss you so much. Bye.